Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel, and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing video and I'll be unboxing the Ecovax DBOT N79 Robotic Vacuum Cleaner. In the past, I have uh, unboxed and reviewed another robotic vacuum cleaner, which is iLife A4, a robotic vacuum cleaner, which I'll provide a link in the description box below. And today I'll be unboxing this one to give you another review. And I'd like to mention that this is not a paid or affiliated review. Uh, this is purchased. Uh, this was purchased with my own money, and the opinions and uh, review you are going to get is uh, totally unbiased and honest. So let's go with the unboxing. Uh, the first thing uh, I'd like to mention that uh, actually there's another big box which I threw out. So this was uh, inside another big box and then this box and there's another box underneath inside this one. So the whole uh, thing was uh, covered by three separate boxes. I do not understand why you need so many boxes. Uh, you'd, it would be just fine to have one box so right now we're gonna to have to go through two different boxes so let's get going here so I'll uh, remove this from uh, this box right here okay so I'll set this aside here and here we have uh, the robotic vacuum cleaner So here is on the other side of the box and there's nothing else here so just uh, take it out from here okay I don't wanna break this one so I'll just put it here live flat and take it out this way so just... okay so let's remove this cover and we have this protection layer, I'll set it aside here. And then we have a brochure here, so which is a quick start guide. And uh, let's just quickly take a look at it. Okay, so it just gives you initial setup and everything. Uh, one of the features which I like about this robotic vacuum cleaner is that you can connect it to your smartphone and then you can uh, uh, schedule the cleaning and you can uh, do other things from using your smartphone which usually uh, not available for a low cost uh, vacuum cleaner like this. So this one is about uh, 200 to 300 Canadian dollars uh, but there are many other low cost uh, vacuum cleaners but they'll not give you this feature to connect it to your smartphone and use the app. So I'll just uh, set this aside here. So this another protection. And we have here some sort of uh, filter. So it could be additional piece of filter. And then here is the remote control. So let's say if you do not, do not want to use your smartphone, then you have the option to use the remote control, which is a nice feature. And then one set of uh, attachment brush, that what it looks like. So I have a feeling that uh, this is an extra piece uh, in here. It should be complete with everything, so this must be an extra piece. I'll put it here. And then here is the power uh, charger and power cable. So this looks like a standard power charger and power pin. So I'll just set it set here. Okay, so here we have, looks like the base station. 
So this is where the robot will uh, go back to charge or recharge uh, once the charge is finished and then here the robot is going to sleep once uh, after the task uh, completes. So we'll just take it out here. Okay, so this looks like a standard uh, base station. So I'll just put it here. And then now uh, we, we are left with only the vacuum cleaner, which I'll take out right now. Actually, I see there's some other stuff in here, which I'll show you in a while. So we have uh, the attachment brushes, and then there are four pieces here. So I'll just take them out. I'll I'll put them here and there's a pair of batteries for the remote control so which I'll set it here so now we have a empty box so I'll just set the box here and this is the vacuum cleaner we have and let's uh, open it up and I'll remove the plastic cover Okay, so I took out the plastic cover and here is the robotic vacuum cleaner. So the name of this product is DBOT Ecovax Robotics N79. Uh, let me just take a look here. So here looks like uh, the attachment brushes, I have to attach it here and this one is uh, already attached and then uh, here is the wheel and here's the other wheel and here's the dust tray or dust uh, bin so i'm going to charge this initially because i do not know whether you know they they charge uh, at the factory or not so i'll charge the whole thing and then I'll show you uh, a little bit how it works. So I'll attach it to the video later on, and then uh, you'll have uh, an idea of uh, how this uh, product. So I just completed the setting up the vacuum cleaner with my uh, cell phone. So as you can see, that uh, the robot is connected right now, and the battery level is very low. I didn't charge it yet because there is a little bit battery. Uh, which was charged uh, from the factory. So, for example, let's take a look here. If you press, if I press this one right here, then you see that the robot will uh, go to the left. Okay. So if I press the right one, uh, which is right here, it will go to the right. Okay. So let's press this one right here and let's try to clean this one. Uh, so if I hit the auto cleaning. You can see that on the phone it says uh, cleaning right here. Okay, so I'll just uh, stop it for now from the phone. I'll just press on the auto and then in the stopped, and you can see that the status on the app says uh, standby. Okay, so I'll just leave it there. So let's talk about a few more things. What I noticed that uh, these brushes actually uh, I had to put them two on the robot and these two uh, they gave uh, these two are extra 
and uh, the setup for the app is fairly simple you have to search on uh, Google Play or where you download your app from on your phone uh, Ecovax and then you'll get the app and once you install it then you have to just uh, connect it to your home internet network then the app will work from there so it's pretty straightforward and if you don't need the app then you don't have to actually install the app you can just use the remote control but I'll be using the app which is more convenient than using uh, the remote control in terms of noise uh, I have a feeling that this is making a lesser noise than my previous robotic vacuum cleaner which is uh, iLife A4 uh, and in terms of uh, the weight and the size they looks pretty similar uh, they have uh, almost identical uh, shape and uh, weight so the only thing the other one didn't have is the uh, smartphone connectivity but this one comes with the uh, smartphone connection and you can do schedule everything on a smartphone and you can uh, run uh, the vacuum cleaner even from when you're not home using uh, the smartphone so that that's a, a good feature so that's all for now if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and consider uh, subscribing and this is all for today thank you for watching and i'll see you shortly thanks